I as a coach, man, I'm gonna fucking. You guys really get me go. You guys are really getting me to go here. You really get. I'm gonna fucking do it. There's this coach. What the fuck's his name? Dewey fucking Cooper. And I like Dewey Cooper. I think Dewey Cooper is a stand-up fucking guy. He's a great guy. But like Dewey Cooper, man, like this fucking guy. Marvin went to Vegas, and I wanted Marvin to come to Vegas so bad. And then right when he got to Vegas, he got in bed with Dewey Cooper. And I don't know if you guys follow Dewey Cooper, but Dewey Cooper is like the TikTok coach. He's a guy that's like, all right, guys, I'm going to have a speech. Everybody settle down. Give me, a, give me a camera. Like, he wasn't a great kickboxer. Man, I'm going to fucking have to fight this guy when I see him now. I'm going to see this guy in the gym. I mean, we're fucking fighting. He wasn't a great kickboxer. He wasn't... A fucking, he wasn't good at all. I mean, if you look at his record, it's all fucking red. But for some reason, this fucking man has a stable of fighters. And he's like a glorified, uh, glorified cardio kickboxing coach. And I just don't understand how the, like, and this is what I'm fucking talking about with you Instagram fucks and you TikTok or you younger generation. Like, it's so easy to be a fucking fraudulent motherfucker. So the issue with Marvin is he went and he went to Dewey Cooper's cardio kickboxing and he's just been smashing pads. He's not getting better. He's not improving. He's not like Marvin needs someone to break him down, to bring out the fucking coloring book to say, all right, Marvin, this is what you got to do. And I really think that after this fight, you know, maybe, maybe he sees a light and now he just goes full-time extreme because he, he's not an extreme fighter. He may spar with us once or twice, but he's not an extreme fighter. And the moment he finally sacks the fuck up and, and, you know, put somebody in a position of authority. And, and Marvin's the kind of guy, like, I don't need to put people in authority to me. I don't need a coach. I like Eric. He's a stand-up fucking guy. He's a good leader. But Marvin's the kind of guy, dude, that he needs to, he needs to worship you. He needs to be like you are in a position of authority. So in conclusion to this fucking rant, I know Marvin got, he got a little, be a little beat up. But in conclusion, 